All right, now it's been a few days since we have received the One UI 6.0 stable variant on the Galaxy S23 series. However, with the stable release, we did not get the security patch for November 2023. Whereas the Z Fold 5 and the S22 series are currently on One UI 6.0 beta and they have received the current month's security patch a few days ago along with the beta version itself. Now, Samsung has pushed an all new update to the Galaxy S23 series. This is the Galaxy S23 Ultra here. After a few days of the One UI 6.0 beta release, we have finally received the security for November 2023 for the Galaxy S23 Ultra. As you can see, the size is about 338.05 MB and the version number ends with BWK5. In the changelog, it just talks about the security of the device, device stability improvements and bug fixes, new or enhanced features, but there is no new features added with this update. And it also says further improvements to performance. This is a regular uh, changelog we see with all the security patches which we get. Now, as far as the Galaxy S23 is concerned, uh, the One UI 6.0 stable has been running pretty well. The battery performance has been pretty good. I've already shared the battery test results a few days ago. If you missed that video, you can go ahead and check that out. This phone is delivering about eight to nine hours of screen on time on the standard performance profile with QHD display. That's a pretty good battery life we are getting on this device. Uh, we did not see any change in battery performance after the update of One UI 6.0. It's pretty much the same, I would say. Coming to the performance of this device, this is a beast. Uh, it's, it's a pleasure to use this particular phone here. Compared to any other flagship phone Samsung has made in the past, this feels really great. And I'm sure if you are owning this device, you will be feeling super happy about this phone. And I'm sure you must be enjoying this device. Now, after the release of One UI 6.0, we have seen one minor issue with respect to the animations or the widgets. Whenever we open the widget and go back to the home screen, while using the navigation gestures, the animation was not perfect. It was not going back to the same position whenever you open the widget and go to the home screen the widget moves back to the bottom of the screen instead of going back to its original position now this is working fine on the z fold 5 whereas on the s22 ultra as well as s23 ultra this is not working fine when the swipe navigation gesture is turned on otherwise uh, the phone the one ui 6.0 has been doing really great without any major issues i did not see any stutters or lags on the phone the applications open pretty smoothly the animation transition effect is great and it really feels refreshed and feels great using this One UI 6.0, especially on the S23 Ultra. That's all I want to share with you guys. You let me know whether you have received this update or not. Drop a comment. And I hope you have already subscribed to the channel. If you haven't done it already, go ahead, hit the subscribe button and become a part of Apex community to know your phone better. And if you're interested in this particular wallpaper, I have left a link for that uh, to download in the description. You can go ahead, click the link and download the wallpaper. Every new video I post, I will be posting a brand new wallpaper so you can go ahead and download them. You can check out all my other videos to get some cool wallpaper papers so go ahead and check them out that's about it thanks for watching my name is salian signing off cheers bye bye